today we are here to talk to them about the NAE Regional Conference that's happening at our school. So um, let's begin with the first question. So what is the objective of the NAE Regional Conference? We're just curious. That's a great question. The title of the conference is Innovate. So we are essentially looking at ways of sharing ideas and best practice on how to innovate effectively in teaching and learning. So the people that are attending the conference are teachers and school leaders who like to come together to share best practice and ideas. And innovation is about the cutting edge of uh, research and development and best practice. So we're coming together to share and learn with the world. How do you feel about I am really excited by it. This is my second uh, regional conference that I've been to, and the last one was in the Middle East, in Qatar. And it was, I found it a really valuable experience, getting to know colleagues. Um, I now, from that conference, have a group of other school leaders that I know and can turn to for support and advice um, if there's something that I you know, need to be doing in my school. Um, so it's great connection, um, and it's also great to learn what other schools are doing and how other schools operate. It helps us to get better at learning from other schools. So, is there a specific reason why it's happening here at the IIT Nori? Is it chose, chosen at random, or...? It's a great question. Um, essentially, the principals across the Southeast Asia, Middle East and India schools, that's the 26 schools, we try and alternate the different location um, across two main regions. So we alternate each year, one Southeast Asia one year, and the Middle East the other. And essentially, uh, the, the schools in, in both areas find it easier. So it's about geography and then it's about uh, accessibility. Um, so we alternate. And it was Southeast Asia's turn. And uh, myself uh, and uh, Mr. Paul uh, Hollyhoe, who is the uh, uh, principal of BBIS, both said, put our hand up and said, what about Hanoi? And we can work together as two schools to, to host it as well. So double back. Okay. Yeah. What are you most excited about? I'm most excited about um, meeting new people and learning and hearing about new ideas that will stretch my thinking and my understanding and knowledge. Even though I've been in education for many years, if I can come away with some nuggets of, of new thought and, and practice and have met new people, uh, I always feel I grow as a human as a, uh, and as a professional. I'm also excited about showcasing our school. So we'll have over 200 people at our school on Monday. So when you guys are actually in lessons, um, so they're going to get a chance to see lessons, see our school, meet some students. Um, I'm really proud of our school and I'm really looking forward to showing our school off to everybody as well. So what I've learned so far is that the aim of the conference is to um, build on how learning can improve and innovate it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's correct. So how often does events like these occur? Like, really big events where many um, heads and principals come to one area? That's a great question. For the region, it's once a year. So we alternate between Middle East and Southeast Asia. Um, that's when our leadership teams, so that's the principals and heads of primary and secondary and other key leaders within the school who lead on teaching and learning come together. Uh, as principals, um, uh, we get together a uh, second time in the year we do that in Switzerland uh, every year, uh, but we also join with our central team in London and the regional teams from around the world. So that's all, uh, I think we're at 87 schools uh, around the world in 33 countries. So we do that once a year, and in addition, we do the regional conference, which we're hosting um, once a year. Just out of curiosity, how many North Anglia schools are there? 87. In total? In total, I believe, and growing. <laughs> and there's also, just to add on to what Mr. Vaughan was saying about frequency of these kind of events, there's also North Anglia regional events for students, where students get together from different countries for various purposes. So for example, this month, there's a North Anglia regional performing arts festival, where all of the, the schools from the region get together and they do dance, drama, music focus, 
Um, next year there's a student leadership conference as well for the region. So all of the head students and prefects from the different schools in the region, they will come together and do some professional learning about um, leadership. So it's for teachers, but we also have things for students. Yeah, and I'm just going to add to that, there is another dimension, which is non-teaching, uh, which we run a similar model for our administrative staff. So our functional leads from our HR, as our human resources, our finance, our facilities, they get together every year in one of the schools in the region as well to share, again, best practice. But our focus for this conference is teaching. You gave us really good, full, clear, and enriching answers. Thank you so much for your time today. Our pleasure. Thank you. Thanks for having us. Well done.